The Terial Kenosha bighorn sheep herd at one time was one of the largest and most well-known herds in the country, but it has since seen declines over the years. Multiple disease events since the 1950s reduced herd population numbers through direct mortality and low success rates raising lambs. Today's depressed population has not rebounded since the last disease epidemic between 1997 and 2000. Colorado Parks and Wildlife has launched a new multi-year project for this iconic bighorn herd so we can implement management tools to help Colorado State Mammal repopulate the high Rocky Mountain terrain. We are using both helicopter capture and ground immobilization to place 30 GPS tracking collars on use. The remote nature some of these bighorns are located in makes it necessary to do capture work via helicopter. CPW is working in conjunction with United States Forest Service and the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service on this project to obtain the necessary approval for work in the Lost Creek Wilderness. This project is one biologists are hoping will address three main objectives. We seek to estimate population metrics including abundance and survival to help in assessing the population dynamics of the herd and to evaluate causes of mortality in ewes and lambs. We want to identify factors limiting population recovery by assessing habitat characteristics, distribution and range use, predation rates, disease and herd health, and possible human impacts. We will use the data obtained to identify and implement management tools to improve the performance of the herd and apply that to other herds across the state. This herd has been the source for over 20 bighorn translocations that have helped reestablish populations throughout Colorado and beyond. The genetics of this herd are native to our state. The collars will last for three to four years, so ideally we should obtain beneficial data from several lambing seasons. Lambing is going to be one of the main things we are looking at to identify why recruitment into the population has been low, and we will track the lambs after they are born by following the collared ewes. Ewes will be monitored for survival, health, and cause of mortality. The Terriel Kenosha herd has been classified by CPW as a Tier 1 population of greatest conservation need. Tier 1 groups are regarded as those large native populations comprised of one or more interconnected herds that have received little, if any, supplemental releases in the past. These represent native populations with the greatest genetic diversity who have been able to persist despite various adversities. Today in Colorado, the overall bighorn population is estimated to be approximately 7,000. 